for nothing. But I feel like this, man. That nigga Irv Gotti, man. You know what I'm saying? He came to me before all that shit, before he even got the Dev Jam. He said, yo, what up? He see me in the club. Like, yo, Fredro, man. I'm like, what up? He said, yo, that nigga, um, Leo just offered me a job to be an a and I'm like, well, you better take that shit, nigga. He was a little nigga doing little mixtapes on, on the street. He was running with my niggas and shit, you know what I'm saying? From, from my man Bebo and them niggas. Some real niggas from motherfucker that part of town. God bless the dead, my nigga Bebo. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, yo, nigga, you better take that motherfucking job. He's like, all right, cool. So boom, I feel like the kid had alternative motives, you know what I'm saying? Hitting agendas because he had his little crew job on them niggas. That's cool, you know what I'm saying? But I felt like the nigga put motherfucking, a motherfucking monkey wrench in our shit. Like, I felt he was the, the bottom denominator nigga that was hating. You know what I'm saying? He was the nigga that was hating probably in the meetings like, nah, fuck Onyx.